Hello, and welcome back to the Switzerland Video Diaries, finally. This is definitely one of my favorite days to look back on because it was a really funny day. You'll see. We took the train into Winter Thur, which is a neighboring town near Zurich, walked around a little, and then my mom decided that she wanted to bike, so we went in search of bicycles to rent. Little did we know that we would end up getting severely lost, climbing a huge hill, and biking 17 miles. I'm just really glad that I got the day on film and that I get to look back at it like this. What? Do you know I'm not putting my bag under there. Yes, I probably know. Yes, I know. I know the shoes. Yeah. We don't have the date. Um, bike. Yeah, it is. Um, Yo, sometimes get me. you do have specific bike lights. Oh. This is my favorite video. Huh? Yeah. Mona Lisa men have named you. You're so like the lady with the mystic smile. Is it on me? Oi, oi, tá gostando? For that Mona Lisa strangeness in your smile. Do you smile to tempt a lover? Or is this your way to hide a broken heart? Many dreams have been brought to your doorstep. They just lie there and they die there. Bro, this is insane. This is so pretty. There's Maria. We ended up parking the bikes and walking around for a bit because we were all very tired and very hungry. When we got the bikes back, I didn't get any footage because it turned out that we were very far from where we needed to return the bikes and we didn't think we'd make it. Everyone was a little bit on edge and we had to work double time and we did get lost. But it's one of those things that just gets funnier with time. Tired? How was it? Okay, I'm so thirsty. You thirsty? Yeah. You. <laughs> 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 My, how was it? Bye, are you a little sweaty? <laughs> Bye, did we get a little lost? <laughs> oh my god, I'm like, this is so sweaty. Yeah, I think she went in the wrong direction for a, a while. Oh my god. <laughs> Mas a gente já tinha subido mais do que descido. Yeah, yeah. A segunda descida era o best. Tem água. Bro, that was so difficult. We just biked 17.5 miles. Literally, the half of which we were doing full speed, trying to get back, because we had to get back by six. And now we're at the supermarket. I'm so sweaty. Had no bra on. So I'm buying this as a reward. Is it good? Oh, 
Tschüss. Danke, tschüss, tschüss. <lacht> We just made it to Mount Titlis. The mountains are literally on every single side and it's crazy. It's a two hour train to get here and this is insane. Like I can't even, it looks like, it looks like we're in a postcard. <laughs> it feels like someone put me in a big snow globe. No, it's like here you go. This is crazy. But okay. we're planning on hiking. We're all geared up. We don't know what's gonna happen, but hopefully we'll drive here to go hike. Honestly, Maybe one more yeah. Maria thing to do. Get out my record when you go away. People are talking. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I miss what I say. Cause it all means nothing, my dear. If I can't be holding you near, just tell me you love me. That's all I we began our ascent up Mount Titlis, which consisted of two separate cable cars. We were in complete awe the entire time of the scenery and the mountains and the cows. Everything was absolutely insane and unreal. So we went up to the highest part of the mountain, which was very cold. They had a ton of attractions, like an ice cave that we went in and tried not to fall. After we came down from the mountain, we found a little hiking trail and we took a short hike around the base of the mountain. I don't need the crowds and the cheers, but just tell me love me. Just found out that we were actually inside a mountain. This whole time I thought it was like the Disney thing where it's like fake ice. It's real ice. We're inside a glacier. I. I didn't realize that, but... Hi, how you doing, Explorer? <laughs> With your little backpack. Before, but hearing it from you means much more, so much more. This is hard. Why? Bye, how are you? Uh, Tired? Uh, Mike, how are you? Back over for you. do we make it back? Yeah, thanks. Good morning. It's 11 in the morning, and we are finally leaving Zurich, sadly, to go into our next location, Bern. We're supposed to have checked out of the Airbnb at 11, but we're a little late. So now we're just gonna leave the Airbnb. Kinda sad to leave Zurich, I really liked it, but I feel like Bern is gonna be really nice, so. I'm excited, but I'm sad that the first leg is done. We were so sweaty, we just spent 10, 15 minutes playing Jenga with this, and they're all in. Oh no, there's one more, there's one more. It's not fitting. Oh, 
Can I sit in the front? Two hours earlier than our Airbnb is ready, so now we're killing time in a mall. But I like your shirt. What does it say? Come. What does your shirt say? Hush, fresh, shop. No, your shirt. Buy your shirt. <laughs> We've officially arrived in Bern. It's 3:40. I've been laying down for about half an hour, even though I spent the entire day in the car. I feel like I should sit some more, if that makes any sense. Hey y'all. We're in Old Town Burn, awaiting my dad to get coins so that we can park the car. It's blue, we named it Say the name. Yes, we did. You named it? Okay. Edward. A horrible name. We didn't name it Edward. We named it. We named it. We named it. PP. We named it PP. <laughs> now go back to the other position. So we were all very tired. We were pleasantly surprised by Bern, which was very old style European with cobblestone streets and little shops. We also discovered this river that flows through the town and basically everybody swims in it. Everyone has these water resistant floating bags that they carry with them in the river and they float downstream until they want to get out. We originally thought that we would be able to go in, but it seemed like the current was a little strong, so we stuck to land. We spent a couple of hours exploring the area and going in and out of stores as it started to downpour later in the day. 